what's up guys and welcome back to another video right into my youtube channel today i'm going to basically tell you how to fix every kind of crashing lagging or freezing error you're currently having or issue with team fortress 2 so stick to the end guys this will be a step-by-step -step tutorial in the end we'll perfectly know what to do in order to fix this kind of issue before we start right into the video i just want to you guys know or let you guys know that, that i would really really appreciate it if you would just leave a like a comment or a subscription right into my youtube channel it would really make my day and help me out as a little youtuber as i am especially subscribing would be such a big support for me guys you would support my work on youtube a little bit and i'm gonna really really be thankful for that and i'm gonna thank you for that so anyways i would just say let's get right started so the first step is gonna be to navigate to the very bottom of your screen where you're gonna right click your taskbar and you're gonna open up your task manager Afterwards, I want you to navigate to the top left corner of your screen, clicking onto processes. And once you click processes, I want you, and it's going to sound a little bit weird, guys, but trust me, it will help you, to end every single task. So let me explain that. Two reasons for that. First of all, too many applications, programs, background processes, games, whatever, running at the same time on a low-end or bad PC will cause crashing and lagging or freezing because your PC can't handle that anymore. And the second reason is that, like it was for me, there are some applications, programs, whatever, running, which are currently third parting your main game causing it to crash or to freeze in some way so you're avoiding this issue and helping you a lot with that when you're basically just ending every single task and once you did that i want you to enter task manager again and the next step is going to be to search an empty spot right into your monitor or your desktop you're going to right click and hit display settings once you hit display settings i want you to navigate to the top left corner where you're going to click onto display or stick around it and afterwards, simply just identify which your main monitor is. And obviously, this just applies if you have more than one. So once you did that, scroll down and hit scale and layout. I want you to change the size of text apps and other items to 100% as recommended. And the display resolution should be the same as in-game. So for example, if you have an in-game 70, 20, but 70, I also want you to do this for a display resolution. Once you're finished, simply anti settings and navigate to the bottom left corner where you're going to click onto the Windows symbol and open up your settings. What I want you to do here is going to be to click into update and security, stick around Windows update, where I obviously want you to change or basically download or upgrade every single drive you could possibly update on your PC starting with Windows. It will help you a lot for every kind of issue currently having and also with crashing, lagging or freezing. So just trust me guys and download the latest version of that. Once you downloaded it, end this task and do the same thing for a graphics card. So go to the browser, go to the application and download the latest version of your driver just to provide the best possible performance in general for your PC. Yeah guys, that's it for the video. I hope that I could actually help you out of this one. If it was like that, just leave a like, a comment, or a subscription. I'm gonna really be thankful for that. And yeah guys, I'm really sorry if I couldn't help you, but I'm just gonna do my master order to help you out. Either way, I hope you guys have a wonderful day. See you at the next one, and bye.